Hi, I'm Mike Sides. Uh, and my character is uh, Tom Desenzio. And I'm Adam Rath, and I play Mark. My, my character is definitely um, self centered and, um, you know, I think really only looking out for his best interests. Somewhat ditto. My character is a very driven character. Not saying he's driven in any good direction. But he's driven in trying to accomplish that. Well, these are the kind of roles that you want to sink mm -hmm. your teeth in as an actor. You know what I mean? Like, if, you know, you were playing likable characters, people would be like, who gives a shit? Yeah. This is boring, <laughs> you know? But it's fun to be hated when you have an audience. If you could change one thing specifically about them, what would it be? You got a thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> well, apparently... Uh, actually, no, no. All right, I think this is a fair one. If there's something we can change about our characters. We don't get to have any fun and screw around with each other. If you saw what we did back, like, after they call cut, you would see us screwing around yeah. and joking. Yeah. <laughs> What's the most challenging part of playing your character? I even had, like, two months to really, like, flesh this character out. You're hopping around from scene to scene, and sequence of time is, is all off, so, I mean, it's just, I don't know, it's weird. <laughs> <clears throat> I mean, actually, it's the, the structure of it is very different yeah. for us, because, I mean, we're both people who spent most of, I mean, I've almost exclusively spent all my time on stage. I enjoy it. I enjoy the arc of a character yeah. in a play, and it's very different trying to play that arc when you find yourself one day at the beginning, one day at the end, then somewhere two-thirds in, and then back at the beginning. It's been a very interesting process. I've been, since I've spent most of my time on stage, I've been free to play in ways that I don't often get to play in. So it's a very good growing experience. It's a great group of people. And is there anything else you'd like to say? Or perform? Well, we have been working on the West Side well, Story. Now. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, there's going to be a musical aspect, a song and dance. Yeah, but that's I mean, going to be like the DVD. We, we haven't been to, able to really decide on. Uh, I mean, like I've been leaning a little bit more towards hip hop. I like. I, I just don't. I don't. I don't want to do the posse hands. I don't want right. to do the posse hands. Well, we're both theatrical triple threats, so you're going to have to wait to the DVD. Yes, yeah, so, I mean to see. It, we haven't worked out whether there's posse hands involved. I mean, like. I, I would like to throw a little bit more of a modern hip hop edge into it. Yeah. And, yeah. Well, all that, and I don't want to. I don't. I mean, you know, I don't want to upstage. I mean, but then again, I, I don't. Laura I don't want to lock us into a format. Until, I mean, we should be able to feel free to play in a more experimental sense. You know, yeah. really I I expound on the ideas of what theater and film and dance can all work together. To create. <laughs> what are you we talking about? We have no idea. <laughs>